Hey everybody, this is Joel Toppin here, and I just got a box in the mail from GMT Games, and I'm pretty sure I know what's in it, but let's go ahead and take a look. Underneath the packing peanuts, we have, yeah, there it is, Sekigahara, Unification of Japan. Very nice cover and a very hefty box. Wow. So what we're going to do here is we're going to take the uh, shrink wrap off of this guy. Try to keep it. Oh, look at that. Isn't he pathetic? He wants me to share with him. Well, we're going to pull the shrink wrap off of this and take a look at the inside. Okay, so we've opened up the box. And uh, again, the cover art on this is really, really nice. Very evocative. And this is really the first look, uh, good look I've seen of the cover art. And here's the inside. Looks like we have two bags from which presumably you're going to draw blocks, I assume. And very unusual shaped blocks, it appears. On top of it, there are some cards, two packs, it looks like. The Tokugawa deck. Looks pretty nice. And here we have the uh, Sheeta deck. There's the those look really, really nice. Uh, blocks are unusual for their shape. I mean, it, you've seen your your standard block games, but these are uh, uh, these are a little bit, little bit different. Uh, I assume that they're going to go rectangularly on the map. And it looks like there's going to be some cubes inside this big bag of wood here. That would uh, explain the weight of the game. And uh, there's my packing sheet. Rule book looks to be in color. Oh yeah, real nice. Fully illustrated. This is a super looking rule book, folks. And just kind of thumbing through the thing. It's 20 pages entirely on the back. So, alrighty. Looks like there's a bunch of historic notes. I'm trying to see where the rules end. Uh, looks like the rules end on page 12. So the rules weight appears to be uh, lighter than I think I was expecting. But that just means I get to play it quicker, huh? Uh, label sheet. So that's label sheet number two of two. Label sheet number one of two. Assume here. A couple reference cards. Again, in color. Just one-sided. And a mounted map. Looks really nice. Let me pull it out of the bag here. It's hard to do with one hand. There it is. There's the map. Looks really cool. Um, not sure who did the map artwork. It'll probably be written on the back of the box here. Uh, on the back of the box it says that the art was done by Mark Mahaffey for the, uh, the map. So this is Sekigahara, and that's what's inside the box.